Alright guys, so for this video pretty much I'm just going to be telling you all how to distribute the rackets between Burke, Cassandra, and Vito. And keep in mind that you can kill them because if you skip out on them a lot or if you fuck them over then they're just going to get pissed off at you and you're going to go to war with their people so make sure that doesn't really happen. I don't know if you beat the game with all three members towards the end if you'll get a trophy for that but anyways I'm just gonna be explaining this video isn't really so much of a guide it's more informative so here's the information and here's my strategy that I'm currently doing because as you guys can see I haven't really conquered all the territory or districts if that's how you guys want to put it so anyways we got three people right we got Cassandra which is purple and we got Vito which is blue and then we got Burke, which is Irish, which is green. So now the first thing you guys want to do, once you guys take over a racket, make sure that you give it to, make sure that you give the rackets that are in the same district to the person that you're going to end up giving the district to. This is because let's say there's two districts in downtown, right? You don't want to go off and give one to Cassandra or V. Veto. This is because if you kick them off out of the rackets and you already call them in, they're going to feel like they're getting fucked over and that's just going to frustrate them even more. This is probably one of the worst things you could do. Also keep in mind to rotate between each um, person. So let's say here, the first one I ever gave territory was Vito and I ended up giving him the Barclay Mills over here. And then, so that means that I pushed Burke and Cassandra. I pushed them each once. So the second one that I ended up giving to, which was the Frisco Fields, I ended up giving it to Burke. So now that I gave a district to, and I also, since I already knew I was gonna give it to Burke, I gave him all the rackets. And the other thing is, since I already gave Vito, Vito the first territory that I ever conquered or district, now I'm gonna switch over to another person. And this time I ended up giving the Frisco Fields to Burke, as you guys can see right here, which is why it's green. And now also Cassandra was getting pretty butthurt, but good thing I didn't give her any of the rackets from either of these two districts right here. Otherwise that would have just been it for her. So as you guys can see, I went ahead ever since I conquered the third district which was downtown I just went ahead and gave it to Cassandra I also gave her both of the rackets that were in this district and then the third one let's see here yeah pretty sure the third one I no way the third one was downtown so after you guys um, rotate between the three characters, pretty much my method is just reset the numbers. So this one ended up being the first one again because I reset it and I ended up giving it to Vito. And obviously I give him all the rackets. And then the second one I ended up with Trick Fall Harbor, I ended up giving it to Burke. And now Cassandra was getting butthurt at me again. So. For South Downs, I'm just going to give her all the rackets and of course I'm going to give her the district. And pretty much the last one, which is the Phantom right here, Bayou Phantom, which I really wanted to give it to Cassandra because it just made more sense in my head for some reason. And I, but they didn't really give me any options to conquer this territory. So I'm just going to give the South Downs to Cassandra. So make sure you guys rotate and please make sure you give the rackets to the person that you're going to end up giving the district to. That's about it. Thanks for watching and hopefully this video helped you guys out. Peace.